everyone. Today I will be trying another booksy snack. Fried seaweed with blue cheese. I am not at all excited about this one because I have never enjoyed anything that has blue cheese in it. And it puts me off just the idea of like fried seaweed because I really enjoy seaweed a lot, but I'm not sure why anyone would want to fry it. And this seems like a really bad idea, but I'm gonna go ahead and try this. <laughs> right here on our Japan map of all the different booksy snacks for January's booksy, it shows right here, this is the same thing as this one. And it says that it's from the Gifu Prefecture. So, mm -hmm. Fried seaweed with blue cheese. All right, I'm gonna get some of this. Ew, that does not smell good. That was actually worse than I expected. It smells like rotten eggs and rotten milk combined with some rotten cheese. Oh dear. It smells like fish too. Like seaweed, it'll, it doesn't usually smell that much like fish, but this, oh, this is not gonna be good. I don't know. I don't think it went bad yet, but oh. this is not gonna be fun. Huh. It's a little thin layer of seaweed. I think maybe a little bit of fried blue cheese. Oh wow, this is not gonna go over well. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh my god, oh, I'm not good at all. The first bit was really okay, mm. first bit was okay. It just tasted like a little bit of fried cheese, very mild with a little bit of seaweed. Oh, but the, once you start chewing it though, it gets really bad. And then you get that rotten egg flavor and that spoiled milk flavor. I'm not sure if it's just gone spoiled or gone bad or anything, but it doesn't even taste like blue cheese at all. It does not taste good. All right, I need to go get a drink of water. So that'll be all for the blue cheese fried seaweed.